butterflies welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Beverly and it is really nice to see you today so today we are talking Valentine's Day yes it's coming up that time when we all want to treat ourselves to a new dress a new outfit and unfortunately I can't afford any of the outfits that I want to get and we're not going out for Valentine's so um, instead I'm here to tell you what I would like to wear so that maybe you will get some inspiration, get some ideas. Um, this is the plan. I'm trying to help moving forwards, trying to help you, you all to just feel the most beautiful you can feel. So um, I've picked three of my favourite shops. I have my list here. So my three favourite shops are Lindy Bop, Collective and Joni Clothing. I love these three shops. They're, they're all very different and they're at different price points but um, they're lovely so I'll leave links to everything that I picked out down below so you can find it if you want to go and uh, purchase anything that I suggest today so first of all we're heading over to Lindy Bop Lindy Bop is a great shop I got this dress from Lindy Bop this one right here from Lindy Bop um, last summer and um, I wear a lot of Lindy Bop. If you know me well, you, and you on my Instagram, etc., you will know I love me some Lindy Bop. So first, we're going to start with some shoes, and I picked out these low heel red ballerina shoes. I thought these were so pretty, and because they have a really small heel, um, I thought it'd be great for us in the chronic illness and disability community. You can get a little bit of lift, but you're not going to find it you know easy to fall over in um, I love the red of course Valentine's Day makes you think of reds and pinks and pretty pretty colors like that these shoes are 35 pounds and they are so nice I saw them and I was just like oh my gosh I want those shoes <laughs> because it's just so easy to get caught up in that isn't it like you look at them and you're just like I want them, I want them so bad but um yeah, the next thing I chose was this red petticoat. You've got to have a petticoat if you're going to have a swing dress or a swing skirt on. It just makes them poof out and look really pretty and romantic and flirty. And they're just so pretty, so pretty. I think I've, I own three at the moment and I would own them all if I could because they all are so nice. This one is a lovely red shade and I thought that it would look really nice with this. Audrey pink rose dress oh this dress is so pretty and flirty and romantic I love the flowers all over it and just imagine it with that red petticoat underneath it would just look so cute don't you think I, I just think it would look so cute the petticoat 28 pounds it's not too bad I mean you can pay hundreds for a petticoat so it's not that bad and the dress is 38 pounds um so pretty and then i thought you could put on this rona red embroidered bolero jacket um it's like a little bolero thing because it's still cold <laughs> here in england it's cold most places and so i thought this little bolero would look so cute with this dress and would bring in the red from the shoes and the petticoat and that is 28 pounds Again, I'll leave links to everything down below so you can go and pick them out if you want. And then I thought, you know, you've got to have a bag. You've got to have a bag to finish it off. And I picked this Parker Brown Leather Crossbody Bag. I just thought this would look so cute. I couldn't find a red bag there that I really loved. And I thought, well, brown is going to be a really good investment because you can wear it with any outfit, really. Um... And it's not going to take the attention away from the beautiful dress that you're going to be wearing. Um, this dress, this this bag is £45, which I, I think is a bit on the pricier side. But if you're going to make, if you want to buy a bag that's going to last a long time, it's going to look really nice, really classic, this is a good bag to go for. Next, we're tripping over to Collectif. Collective, I have only like two or three pieces by. They're just slightly out of my price range. 
but um, I love looking on their website and I do sometimes buy myself things from their website when they have a sale on which they have a sale on at the moment so go and check that out they have some beautiful pieces on the sale so collective I thought we could wear this beautiful Francis polka dot swing dress isn't this beautiful this is 60 pounds and um, this dress is stunning it's not like overtly Valentine's like the other dress was but I just thought it was so pretty um, I also chose this Caroline Cape coat I mean look at the Cape coat people if this was tweed I would sell a kidney for it I'll be honest I would sell a kidney for it it is beautiful the coat is 49.50 that's in the sale at the moment so go and grab it while you can um, and I thought underneath you could wear this lovely white Maddie petticoat which is 38 pounds which I don't think was too bad really these are this is would make such a cute little outfit to go out in the coat would keep you warm because capes actually keep you warmer than a coat it's really strange but it, it does it does keep you warmer and then I picked out these Corinne glitter block heels and this um, beautiful retro kiss lock bag I thought those two together would just finish it off perfectly um, and I just oh I wish I could buy this outfit isn't it gorgeous the coat alone the coat alone yes oh. And then lastly, we head on over to Joni Clothing. Now, Joni Clothing don't sell bags and shoes. So for that, we had to go back to Lindy Bob. But Joni Clothing have this beautiful Dorothy floral midi dress, which I just thought was so perfect for like a day date. I love the red floral on it. I love that it's got long sleeves. It's just gorgeous. It just really is gorgeous. And you could pair that with the cape coat and... <laughs> I'm shooketh myself <laughs> then I headed back over to Lindy Bop and I picked out this um, leather flat shoes for £55 and this natural straw basket handbag which I thought would look really nice in the daytime for a day date say you go to the cinema or just out for lunch or something like that it would just look so pretty these outfits are gorgeous and if you have any of these or if you buy any because i said definitely let me know down below and definitely definitely tag me on instagram the all my instagram and everything are down below and i will leave links to everything that i mentioned in this video in the description so you can go and get whatever tickled your fancy um a couple of other things are on sale so go and snap them up while you can I have always really enjoyed Valentine's Day, whether I've had a date or not. My husband, I think, is working on Valentine's. So I don't think we'll be doing anything special. I usually make him a card. Um, we don't usually give presents to each other, but it's just a day to remember the person who loves you, whether that's your mum, your granddad. When I was little, my granddad always sent me a card for Valentine's Day with like guess who and a big question mark um, every single year uh, <laughs> so he was my valentine's for most of my life so I think it doesn't matter whether it's a best friend whether it's a mother, father, grandparent whoever it is let the people around you know that you love them use valentine's day as a way to just spread the love around that sounded wrong but I hope you know what I mean be nice to each other, be kind, go onto Instagram and leave lovely, lovely messages on everybody on your feeds, pictures, just go to town with it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, I often do vintage fashion videos, so um, definitely click that little subscribe button down there, ring that little bell, so you always know when I upload. Mondays and Fridays are usually my days. Um, I've got some exciting things to come, so definitely make sure you're subscribed. I really enjoyed this. I enjoyed looking through all the websites and picking out the things that really spoke Valentine's Day to me. 
so um, let me know what you think let me know anything down below because I love chatting to you guys I really do I really enjoy talking to you all I hope you have a lovely weekend the weekends are time to relax for a lot of people so definitely take that time to just recharge the old batteries um, yeah have a lovely couple of days make someone smile every single day and I will see you here next time bye Bye. <laughs>